morning, helping low-income families grow fresh produce in their own backyard this summer. It's being made possible by the Love Sea Bus Family Garden Initiative. And joining us this morning are Rich Johnson, pastor of the Sanctuary Columbus Church, and Alex Marks, director of the Family Garden Initiative. Gentlemen, thanks so much for being here so early with Thank us you. this morning. Thank you for having me. First, tell me a little bit about why your church is getting involved in this. I know it's the first year. It's the first year, and we see there's a need in Central Ohio. Uh, families need their own uh, fresh produce, and this is just an easy, affordable way to provide that for a family of four. And uh, Alex, we know that eating well can be expensive, fresh produce. Yeah. Oftentimes, one of the most expensive items in your, your car. Talk about how this is being made so affordable for these families. Yeah, well, um, as the Family Garden Initiative, um, we started a couple of years ago as an outreach program and a partnership with Church of the Open Door and Hilltrax Foundation to reach families that were struggling with their bills and, and having a hard time providing produce. So what we did is we, we kind of used this, this system and this model of, of fundraising to build gardens um, using basically these socks that can go anywhere. And in urban cities, it's hard to find good soil. So we can put these on a patio or a deck or bad soil and plant right in it and grow. And I, I brought some plants to show. But this is not a difficult process. Yeah. We just kind of cut and open up, and there's compost inside, and we drop our plants in there, and that's it. And how much maintenance does that take? Very little. There's there's no weeds, and there's no weed flowing in, and um, you water throughout the year, so it's a simple system to learn, because we're trying to reteach gardening where folks haven't gardened in a long time, so there's an education process that goes along with that. So. And Rich, who are you reaching out to? Who, who is eligible for participation? We're reaching out to families who are who are at or below the poverty level. So families who are who are constantly visiting uh, food pantries, uh, families that are uh, at free or reduced lunch in the Columbus public school system. And we have over 200 people that we're gonna be delivering gardens to today. Okay, and, and what all is gonna be included in the gardens? Let's talk about that. Yeah, so um, each uh, family, each recipient gets uh, eight of these. These are, these are called garden socks. Um, and it's enough area for a traditional four by four raised bed garden if you have a picture in your mind, so about four feet by four feet. Uh, there's about 21 plants that we put in each garden that we deliver, both from plug or from start, uh, as well as seed packets, and there's all your traditional stuff, tomatoes, peppers, herbs, um, you know, beans, zucchinis, things of that sort. So you get the plants in the system, uh, a watering can to help monitor and the watering in the garden, um, a little educational booklet, uh, how to harvest what's in the garden and when to, to you know, how to take care of it, part of that education. And then ultimately, uh, a nice recipe book with you know how to take advantage of the local or the, the fresh produce that's that's grown in the garden because that's one of the difficult parts is knowing actually how to use fresh produce. Now. And, and Rich, we are running out of time, but this is really about feeding the body and, and feeding the soul. Yes, uh, we, we want to care holistically for the whole person. Uh, our church was started because we wanted to get out into the community and to care well for their spiritual bodies as well as their physical. Gentlemen, it's a great program. Thank you so much for bringing it to us this morning. Thank you. Thank you. And we'll be right back. These guys are okay. right